All right, good morning, guys. We are going to go over the 311 packing bag. This is the airline approved version of the one quart Ziploc bag. For years, I used a Ziploc bag, the one quart size, and I fit in there what I could. Then I found out the miracle that is a 311 bag. So it is roughly the size around of the one quart bag. However, this has a nice depth to it and I've been traveling with it for two years and have never had a problem and it is, of course, airline approved. So, carry on approved. So, I'm going to show you everything that I have in here to show you that it is absolutely possible to bring everything you need, liquid form, in one um, 311 bag, which is all you're allowed to take. And also, let me apologize for the background noise. We have a new puppy, and she follows me everywhere I go, and she's bossy. So, okay, so here's the 311 bag, and I'm going to open it and show you everything I have in it. Okay, so I have two things of shaving cream, because one is typically not enough. So there's two things of shaving cream. In here, I have my laundry detergent packed, and it's real the real concentrated kind. I picked it up at Publix, and the size of a quarter does an entire load of laundry in the in the in the sink while we're traveling. Okay, let's see here. I have a stain remover. I have the um, hand sanitizer, which actually you can buy airside um, and not have to put it in your 311 bag, but I just, I have plenty of room, so I did. Here I have um, hair product for doing my hair if that happens. I have my toothpaste. I have hairspray. This is empty. It's what I'll put my foundation in. And this is my shampoo. Again, it's a super concentrated Paul Mitchell shampoo. And then this is, um, let's see what I put in here. Oh, this is my DEET. And then um, I will buy sunscreen at our hotel in Nairobi. So, like I said, this 311 bag holds everything you need. There's Even when it's full, I still have room to put... Um, additional items in there when you go to Walmart or Target you'll see in their travel like their little trial size area they have these little round disc things that you can also buy um, and they go nicely in the little spaces that are left in here so hang on it's a little pain to put everything back in but um, this is what you're allowed to take on the airline it's carry-on approved. You may bring one of these bags filled with as many containers in it. None of the containers can have more than three ounces of liquid in each container. And um, so if it's four ounces, you're going to have to transfer it into a three ounce. And hang on one second here. So there's this. Take some doing to get it back in there. And then, of course, we have my toothpaste. And like I said, there are little tiny round... Um, like if you want to bring, I don't know, I can't imagine what other liquids people might need, but um, if you want to bring anything else, you'll just, hang on here, there's that, there's that, and it's ready to go. So um, please um, post any questions you have underneath, and I'll answer them. I'm going to end the broadcast now and leave this up for everyone to see throughout the day. And um, if anyone else needs more packing videos, let me know. I'll do that too, okay? All right, we are 13 days till departure.